Last week, Trump declared a national emergency to build a wall along the U.S.-Mexico border after Congress passed a bill that didn't allocate enough funds for the project. Combined, around $8 billion can be spent on the border wall. Here are the facts. Number one. In 1976, Congress passed the National Emergencies Act, which gives the president the authority to expand his or her executive power. President Ford intended to give presidents the ability to respond quickly in the event of a crisis, but didn't explicitly define what constitutes an emergency. Number two, since the National Emergencies Act was passed in 1976, presidents have declared national emergencies 58 separate times. Of these 58 declarations, 31 are still active. On average, they last 13 years. Number three, according to Bloomberg, most past emergency declarations have been related to foreign policy crises. However, there have been instances where national emergencies have been declared to help the nation's domestic challenges, such as the 2009 H1N1 pandemic. Number four, President Trump's declaration of a national emergency to construct a wall along the U.S. southern border will be met with legal action. Representatives Ocasio-Cortez and Castro have announced plans for a bill to stop it. Additionally, the ACLU and Protect Democracy plan to challenge Trump in court. Number five, so far, President Trump has declared three national emergencies. The first was a list of people involved in serious human rights abuse. The second was designed to prevent meddling in U.S. elections, and the third looked to block property of people contributing to the situation in Nicaragua. Those are the facts. See you next time.